Yo, what's going on? I'm Ruslan Saibo here and today I'm traveling all the way to Portugal to provide the workshop. I didn't bring my camera on purpose, I just, just didn't want to, I gotta be honest with you. And yeah, I'm gonna show you all my trip. It's just a weekend trip, so three days. Uh, yeah, let's get it. Having a quick snack, salami, salami sandwich. Nothing special, but it's gonna keep us alive for a bit. <laughs> so, yeah. So we've just landed. I'm here in Portugal. So we're just gonna head out of the airport and uh, this is it. I'm in. I Alright fam, so I've just arrived to the gym where I'm supposed to provide the workshop tomorrow. Looks official, looks really great. The acoustics are really awesome so everyone can hear me yeah
Alright fam, so we did the workout in this gym right there. So we did four sets and the sets were um, one pull up, one muscle up, one bar dip ten times. Then it was a gut set, 50, 50 pull ups, one muscle up, 50 bar dips. Then we did the set 10 pull ups, one muscle up, eight pull ups, one muscle up, all the way to two. And then no more pull ups, just bar dips going up by two to 10. So it's 10, eight, six, four, two on pull ups. And you gotta do the muscle up after each um, pull ups, pull up set to, to, to make it count. And then you go on bar dips from two to 10 and the muscle up after each set of bar dips without leaving the bar. And uh, I look weird here. Like the camera is here and I'm looking at myself and it looks like I'm talking to someone else, but it doesn't matter thinking out loud <laughs> and yeah the last one was one muscle up 10 bar dips 10 pull ups 10 seconds hold 10 seconds hold 10 seconds hold 10 pull ups one muscle up 30 bar dips the atmosphere is crazy the vibe in the gym something else fam love it pretty tired though but yeah we've done the workout during the workout I also uh, started teaching already and yeah totally unplanned teaching it, it, it all comes from the heart you know what I mean it all comes naturally you know what I mean so the workshop is tomorrow but I'm teaching already it's from it's from the passion you know what I mean so I love it so much they asked me one question I'm answering 10 <laughs> before they ask. <laughs> but yeah, I love it, man. Love it. All right. We're gonna go have a dinner and then rest before tomorrow. All right. Yo, good morning, fam. This is my friend right here. He invited me here and um, I'm doing the workshop at his gym. And I've just woke up getting ready for the breakfast and today's the day today's the workshop and i cannot wait for this and uh yeah kind of tired after yesterday's workout and uh, heavy food for dinner but the food was perfect what did you eat what, what did what did we eat it's like a, a steak it's uh, alcatra alcatra the steak was just awesome so yeah um so far i like my trips you know it's perfect and yeah can we cannot wait for the workshop <laughs>
Don't hesitate to ask for advice. For advice. So the workshop is done. I guess it was one of the best I've ever done. And the atmosphere was amazing. Um, I will let you see some of the clips from the workshop. So the topics were uh, endurance, weighted workouts, how to program your workout, <sighs> how to do the muscle up, how to do the clean muscle up, my story, the story of the iron wrist muscle up, everything, uh, how to prepare your body for the skills training, how to connect skills with the strength and endurance workouts, everything. I will, I will put it over here, uh, the, whole, the whole plan, and yeah, <sighs> tired, my voice is way, way down, yeah. Don't even know what to say. Really thankful for the guys from Portugal for being so kind and, and nice. I almost cried in the end of the workout. I mean, in the end of the workshop. Yeah. <laughs> Still working out. Yeah, yeah. One of the best workshops I've ever done. Really. Now we're gonna go to the McDonald's. <laughs> they, they told me that this McDonald's is one of the best. I mean, one of the most beautiful ones in the world. I mean, the, the, the whole design. We'll see, I'll, I'll, I'll show you. <laughs> and yeah, <sighs> crazy tired. Um, I. So I'm taking the walk with the guys around the city and uh, the life is amazing. The nightlife is amazing. I love it. Definitely loving the trip. I wanna come back already. <laughs> right. So fam, today is the match day. <laughs> Wrecking this Portugal national team t-shirt. Of course, it's Ronaldo on the back. <laughs> but yeah, I uh, haven't played for, for a long, long time. I'm pretty excited to play with people who, who love football the way I do. <laughs> Always dream, dreamt about playing, you know, in Portugal and Brazil, stuff, stuff like that. And yeah, um, as soon as we get to the field, um, I'll make some short clips so you can see um, what's going on. Maybe I'll ask someone to record some video of me trying to play. I'm actually on the roof right now. You see some views here. We're like at the suburbs of the Porto. Of Porto. And yeah, um, I'm super, super exhausted. Um, like a week ago, I came back from the vacation 
and I've just came back like I just recovered on Friday and on Friday I traveled all the way to Portugal and you know it's quite intensive intense the whole trip you know all the time you give give out the energy to people who are in the workshop the workshop trainings and stuff like that different food different everything kind of stressed but love it to the fullest and i am i'm pretty excited let's see what happens with this game <laughs> oh yeah we play we're gonna play for 300 squats so maybe you will see me doing squats or you will see me recording the squats all right <laughs> So the match is over. I scored two goals in the first half. I had a lot of chances in the second half, but didn't didn't make it. But yeah, the, the final score is 4-4. The game was so great. Enjoyed it to the fullest. And uh, I have, as I told you, I haven't played in like three years. But yeah, I've got some skills yet. Uh, <coughs> Yeah, it was so hot. It is still so hot. We play, We started playing at um, 9 a.m. and now it's almost 11. So you know the sun goes up and it's killing. It's killing us, especially when you run. But yeah, the game was great. Finally, I, <laughs> I made it to Portugal to play football. <laughs> yeah. So, this is the seafood. I don't even know what it is. It's called Perseps. 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 So, I will try. Not for me, not for me. Just like the seawater. Right? Seawater. Right. So fam, I'm at the Atlantic Ocean. I just wanted to let you know that I feel free. I feel free. Just look at those views, at these views. Beautiful. Inspiring. I'm so free right now. But the grip is so slippery, no chalk. <sighs> So 
So guys, I've just did boxing for the first time. We did like 30 minutes workout. <sighs> I almost puked. <sighs> I thought I will throw up my lungs, you know? This guy right here is a real champion. He taught me some basics. Of course, in one training, I cannot reach even even one percent of what I need to reach. But yeah, it was probably the hardest cardio I've ever done. I've never sweated. I have never been sweating so much in my life. So yeah, um, I'll show you some clips from boxing. Someone recorded it, I guess. I'm a total zero, absolute zero in boxing. But yeah, I think I will start doing it because um, it's a great cardio. And I've got into it right away. Right, like, like after one minute of boxing, of sparrings and stuff like that, of shadow, shadow boxing, I've got into it. I've got so, so into it. All my focus, all my head, all my mind was in it. Crazy, super tired, tired, you can tell it by my eyes. So yeah, fam. <laughs> Talented. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds great. I'm gonna move here. This is the perfect connection of taste. A perfect connection of everything. If we show you this. Excellent mix. If we show you this. I'm at the airport on my way back, just sitting and having this tea. My throat is sore from talking, screaming, from talking on Saturday uh, for like seven hours straight. And after yesterday's football, you know, when I play football, I'm pretty competitive, like everywhere in calisthenics. Any, any, Anything I, I do, I'm competitive in a good way. So, it was one of the best trips I've ever had. Uh, I don't know how much, how, how, how can I describe how much I appreciate, how, how much I, how much I respect I was looking for the word. How much I respect the guys who invited me. Pedro, Paulo, and the guys I've met. Uh, I, feel, I feel like I have become a part of the family this weekend. So yeah, Jose, Felipe, Andres, everyone, everyone.
too many names but yeah I am exhausted so yesterday's day yesterday's day how can I say that yesterday was intense as hell football in the morning in the heat then we're walking uh, through the promenade beside the, the ocean then we did boxing class where I was almost dead I thought I would I thought I was going to uh, throw up with my lungs <laughs> and then we ate francesinha one of the best dish I've ever had You've seen their reaction. <laughs> and yeah. Honestly cannot wait to to go to my bed, lay down and just close my eyes and sleep for like one week. <laughs> but yeah. On my way home. Uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for being here to see this vlog. And I hope there are more um, trips coming despite the situation in the world. Um, yeah, it was one of the best trips and I'm thankful to the guys for inviting me. And I'm, I'm thankful to this guy right here, Mateusz. The one who made this trip even better. No, I still don't wish to let people. I just spoke Polish. So yeah, salute fam. It was unfor and unfor yeah. it was an unforgettable trip. So fam, just landed in Poland and the contrast of the weather is so crazy. So I'm wearing the hoodie already and it was hella hot back then and back there in Portugal. And here I gotta put on another hoodie. This is crazy. It was 28 or 30 degrees in Portugal. And here is like 12, 13, raining. Crazy. But anyways, it was just like I said, it was worth it. Even if I get sick, cold, doesn't matter. It's so good. So I want to say something. It was one of the best trips I've ever had. Not because I've got the good workshop, not because people were satisfied, but because I've met you and I felt like I'm like I'm, I'm a part of a family, and I still feel like I'm a family. And I hope to come back here as soon as possible and spend more and more unforgettable moments with you guys. Obrigado. Obrigado. From the bottom of my heart, thank all of you. Deeply, honestly, sincerely, thank you and I'm happy to be here today. Let's drink this. <laughs> So now we're